Hi everybody and welcome to I Like Cruise Ships, the YouTube channel and welcome to a new video. Now of course you know that I'm not on cruise ships and I'm at home in Australia and I thought today we'd go and do something a little bit different. Uh, I'm here of, of course in Perth, Australia. As you may know I do live in Perth, Australia and I'm at a, a, a container recycling depot uh, which has just started on October 1st. It's called Containers for Change and it allows you to bring your cans and bottles and milk cartons and the like to a return depot like right behind me we're gonna have a walk in in a second and get 10 cents per item refunded now it's not gonna be big money I know for this video but I thought I'd make a video anyway uh, of course not being on cruise ships uh, I have to come up with creative ways to make some content for the channel uh, it's a little bit of a busy road where I'm here so hopefully the volumes okay um, and I've collected a little bag of cans and I've got one bottle and we're going to take them to this uh, recycling building I guess depot and we're going to see how much we get okay let's go so the first thing we need to do is get in the back of my car and get the uh, cans and bottles out this is my car here Hyundai and I have my own number plate Russell 76 it's giving my age, I'm giving away my age a little so we have one bag here we don't have lots and lots, but we're going to head on inside and check out how much money we're going to get back for refunding these few cans and bottles, shall we? So here in Western Australia, the Containers for Change scheme has been going on since October 1st. So it's only been going on a few weeks. As you can see, there's a few cars. Every time I pull up here, every spot is taken. So it's obviously very popular. Now, this is a quite a unique recycling center because it's basically got the ATM recycling method where you basically can scan an app and then there's machines where you can put your cans into this little conveyor belt which we're going to check out and it's going to be super cool and when you first come inside you can see all these different machines right here they look like strange looking ATM machines and everyone's sort of parked up here people have got beer bottles, cans, uh, different things as you walk in here, they actually let you know what you can and can't bring. So what you can return, premix cans, spirits, bottles, containers. And what you can't re uh, recycle, which everyone's a little bit upset about, is wine bottles, juice cartons, milk cartons. But that's okay. This is kind of cool. There's actually uh, shopping trolleys here for you to go out to your car and bring the cans and bottles inside. Now we've only got one bag. So it's not really lots to carry and you'll see other people have just got a few bin bags and the like here so it's not too much. It's a little bit echo in here but it, this is basically the, the front of the building. Now what we'll do is we'll just have a look through this little window here and you can see where all the cans and bottles end up. Now this is actually a little bit of a display window here. And there's a guy here separating all the cans and bottles into different bins. The actual conveyor belt shoots right there and then I guess someone else comes and picks them all up for recycling so let's spin around and what we'll do is we'll go to we'll go to this machine right here so it says here plastic cans and cartons there's another one that's glass so yeah there's a few different sort of terminals and we're all good so let's get started shall we okay so once you've got your ID scanned it comes up with a little screen here and you'll see the little conveyor belt right there. So basically we're gonna grab our first container and they tell us to take off the lids. And I've got the first one with a lid on. That's a good start, wasn't it? So we just basically feed it in and off it goes. And our 10 cents is right there. So not very big money, but I know, but we can drop this one in. Oh, and this one it doesn't like. So basically, if it doesn't detect the barcode, it spits it back out again as not refundable. So let's keep going, shall we? All right. Another one to take the lid off. And in it goes. And we're up to 30 cents. I did put one in with a lid on just then, I just realized, but that's okay. Check that out, picks it up, and we're up to 50 cents. We're getting rich without even knowing it. One more. 
All right, we'll watch this last one go and I'll feed them all in and we'll see what we end up with. So once you're done with your payout here, we've got a whole $1.70 coming back to us. We just press the payout button and we get our voucher that we can then take to the supermarket and get our money back a whole dollar seventy. So as you can see, uh, we're not going to get very rich. A dollar seventy. Uh, <laughs> it's not lots of money, but it's okay. And it's, it is kind of fun to come here. Now, uh, there's a few things to remember. You've got to have no lids on the bottles or containers. Uh, and also, if the, uh, the cellophane or the wrappers took off like a water bottle, it won't pick up the barcode which detects the 10 cent refund. So, and then I asked the lady and she said, oh, you've got to take them home and put them in your own bin. So you can't even leave the ones you can't recycle here. So I've got a couple to take back home and put in the bin. Uh, is it cool? Yes, it is. Uh, am I going to get rich? No, I'm not. Uh, I think I'll stick to cruise ships. I'll stick to <laughs> doing my videos that I do. Um, but yeah, so this container for a change thing, uh, again, it's a new thing in WA. It's been over in the eastern states, Sydney, Melbourne, Brisbane, Adelaide for quite a long time. Uh, the place where we are here is about a 15 minute drive from my house. So it's not overly convenient that it's right where I live. But uh, it's kind of cool to come to the ATM style machine one and do it like I did. I think it's super cool. I'm going to go and pop and see uh, my uncle down in Fremantle, which is about 10 minutes down the road from here. So it's sort of on the way. Uh, there is other recycling drop-offs where you can just basically give them the cans and the bottles and they'll count them and then let you know how much money you get back. It's just not as cool as coming here, so uh, overall I think it's really cool, the experience of it. Um, and I'm going to get my dollar seventy, and I'm going to be, I can buy myself another drink to recycle for another 10 cents off. Uh, anybody else doing this around the world, let me know in the comments. Anybody hasn't seen this before, I don't know. Uh, it's kind of cool for me and unique. Uh, years and years ago when I was basically in primary school, we used to have uh, bottle recycling where you could take them back to the, like, the little corner store or deli as we call them in Perth and get your 10 or 20 cents back depending on the size of the bottle. But then it was sort of done away with a lot of years ago and it's finally back. So yeah, hope you like the video. I like cruise ships, the YouTube channel. Of course, we're not on ships. We're here at home in Perth, Australia on vacation. I hope you like the video. I hope it was kind of something a little bit different and stay tuned for more videos okay catch you later bye